My job is the Parks and Rec Foothills Restoration Specialist with the City of Boise. And today we are out here doing a Weed Warrior event, which is a program that I run, which is about empowering and educating citizens to remove invasive species where they see them. So unfortunately, the sagebrush step of our Boise foothills is, is really degraded, and that's due to a variety of different issues to traffic, urbanization, um, agricultural conversion, and invasive species being one of the major problems that we have. So this beautiful green hue that you see um, in the early spring is actually a function of a lot of the invasive grasses that are pretty prolific in this area. Invasive species compete with the native shrubs, hence there's more invasive species than native shrubs, and so my job is to remove invasive species and then utilize adaptive management try and put the native plants back in place. This year I worked with a service learning program as well as service learning students to help me with restoration as well as um, invasive species removal projects. I believe I had 15 students each semester who owed me 15 individual hours um, each semester, which is actually quite a bit of work. And the students showing up to restoration events in the fall, as well as Weed Warrior activities in the spring, really enabled me to do some quality work. And when volunteer attendance is bolstered by having an additional 15 students, um, I'm able to accomplish so much more, whether it's planting more plants or pulling more weeds. The Boise State students were a really integral part of being able to get boots on the ground and actually accomplish some work. I've been in Boise, Idaho for a decade, and um, I'm somebody who's really passionate about wildflowers as well as invasive species management, which sounds super nerdy, but it's true. And being in a desert ecosystem right in my own backyard has given me this really unique opportunity to use the trails and to use my um, desire to recreate outside as an ability to like find new projects and go to new places and pull new weeds and find new wildflowers that I can collect seeds from that I can grow out for restoration someplace else. And I think that that is pretty cool because not only do I get to be outside for work, you know, I also get to work in a place that I love. <laughs>